Hi, I'm Nellie Kim from LG2 Toronto. I am Partner, Vice President and Creative Director and I'm on the ADC Digital Jury. My pick of the day for today is IKEA Retail Therapy and what it was was IKEA had figured out what the most common phrases that were Googled um, online. What they did was, you know, if somebody Googled something like my husband snores, they had created a website with corresponding, all their merchandise corresponding to those SEO search terms. Uh, and I thought it was just a really creative, interesting way to do something that we generally roll our eyes about, uh, SEO that is. Um, so it was a really interesting way of doing that. IKEA's products have always been inspired by how people live in the real world. There's a variety of everyday dilemmas that can be solved or improved by our products. How could we remind people of this? These days, most of us turn to the internet for answers when problems arise. To prove that IKEA can be a part of the solution, we created what we like to call retail therapy. We simply renamed IKEA's products as common Google searches about relationship problems in Sweden. When you Googled your problem, you found an IKEA product with the exact same name on a site identical to IKEA's main shopping site. A product that might help you improve your relationship at home. So whether it's a snoring husband, a never-ending gaming son, or any other relationship problem you have, IKEA can come to the rescue. Or at least put a smile on your face while you keep Googling for an answer. The results were overwhelming. SEO might be as boring as it gets, but this campaign was something else. Something that won the hearts of both new and old IKEA customers all over the world. Even Google themselves praised the initiative on Twitter. And many of us choose when dealing with relationship problems, retail therapy. And that's what IKEA is calling. Thanks for Googling.